Welcome to Cozy Coast and Glen's Summer Camp Challenges. I'm Diane and I'm going to give you five challenges. I'm also going to give you options of how to make them a little bit more difficult, but remember that they are challenges so you don't want to do them too easy. This is a sheet that you can download so you can record how well you're doing and you can put a little picture of, of you doing the challenge. If you want to share your pictures or videos with us, we'd love to see them, but make sure that you get permission from your parent or carer first. Before you start any of the challenges, again, check with your parent or carer, make sure that it's okay for you to do the challenge and get them to check the area where you're going to be working just to make sure it's safe so that you don't hurt yourself or anybody else and so that we don't damage anything, especially when we're working indoors if we're using balls. Hi, welcome back to Quarter Coast and Glen Summer Camp Challenge. This is day three. So today's challenge is probably easier to be done outside um, and all you need for today's challenge is four cones. And if you don't have cones, you could use anything else as a marker, so tin cans, just whatever you've got handy. Make sure that you've checked with your, your parent or carer that it's okay for you to do the challenge and get them to check the area for where you're going to be working. We're going to be doing it on the grass today but if you're a wheelchair user, it would probably be easier to do it on a nice hard surface. The cones are set up about a metre apart, but again, if you're a wheelchair user, you may need to set them a little bit further apart. I have Alicia with me today to help demonstrate the challenge to you. Okay, so remember, whenever you're trying any of the challenges, make sure you've checked with a parent or carer, and just make sure that the area that you're going to do the challenge is nice and safe, and that you're able, you're able and safe to do the challenge. Okay? So, Alicia's going to demonstrate. So today we're doing the challenge on grass. If you're a wheelchair user, you'd be better doing it on a nice, firm, hard surface. Okay, the cones are set up about one metre apart. If you're a wheelchair user or using a walking aid, you may need to move the cones a little bit further apart. All right, so all you need are the cones and somebody to time you. Okay, so get ready, go. Okay, well done. Okay, so Alicia went in and out all the cones, but she was quite fast, but I think you can do it faster. What do you reckon? Yeah? I think so. Okay, so get ready. Go. Okay, that was faster, but you forgot to go in and out the cones on the way back, so we'll do it one more time. Okay, you ready? Go. Good, keep going, going faster, faster, faster. Well done, yes. Oh, super, well done. Okay, so that's today's challenge. Well done, Alicia, that was super fast and you did all in and out all the cones. Okay, so that was challenge number three, an agility challenge. It's mainly a case of how fast you can change direction, but if you want to make it harder, then you could add a few extra cones. You could hop if you're able. You could run or push backwards. You could introduce a ball, so you could dribble a football with your feet, you could dribble a, a basketball with your hand. Just have fun with the challenge, but remember it is a challenge, so just do something to make it that little bit more difficult. Make sure that you're having fun, stay safe, make sure that you're washing those hands, making sure you're keeping your two metre distance when you're out and about, make sure you stay connected with your family and friends. Enjoy. Okay, bye.